All right, what is up, guys? Boots and Bro Gaming here, and today I have a video for you guys where we're going to be seeing who really is the strongest Sonic character. As I'm putting up 16 different Sonic characters into a 16 elimination bracket, and I will be doing analysis of each matchup, and it's basically who'd win in a fight, and you know we will see who the champion is. So. On the left side of the bracket, we have Sonic, Gamma, Amy, SBO, Vector, Jet, Knuckles, and Storm. And on the right side of the bracket, we have Shadow, Omega, Rouge, Tails, Mephiles, Silver, Blaze, and Metal Sonic. So, let's get into the first match between Sonic and Gamma. Now, Gamma um, obviously has his projectiles he can shoot out, but in Sonic Adventure, we did see Sonic... Gamma wasn't a problem for Sonic, and I think Gamma still won't be a problem for Sonic. So, yeah, I do believe Sonic will easily take out Gamma. Not much debating to happen there. But, uh, yeah, Sonic will be moving on to the next round. Okay, next up we have Amy versus Espio. Now, Amy versus Espio, um... Amy has her Pico Pico Ammer, obviously. SPO has, he's stealthy. Now, how this fight would go down is I think, like, Amy would just be running around everywhere trying to look for SPO while SPO's hiding, just smashing the Pico Pico Hammer. And then SPO would just sneak up and beat her with, and just, like, clob her with an attack and just send her, send her somewhere. So, I think SPO would win that matchup. So... SPO will be moving on to play Sonic in the second round. Then we have Vector versus Jet. Now, Vector and Jet, Jet isn't the best fighter in the world. He does have some powers, though. But he's not the best fighter. Vector, on the other hand, he can just, like... But at the same time, Jet can also use his, like, gear to gather around and, like, do things to Vector. And Vector is you know, always the smartest, but then at the same time, Vector also has his music thing and stuff. Um... In this matchup, ah, uh, this is a tough one. Mm. Yeah, no, this is definitely a tough matchup, but I think I'm going to have to go with... Mm. I think Vector. I think Vector does get the win in that matchup. So Vector will be moving on to the... Round and on the finale, we're gonna have Knuckles taking on Storm. Um, both strong. Knuckles, Knuckles is strong to a whole nother level. Knuckles is the strongest character in the Sonic series. Knuckles is Knuckles is just <laughs> Knuckles is crazy strong. So Knuckles gets the win there, and Knuckles will move on. To the Elite Eight. So, those are the first matchups. Alright. For now, on the right side of the bracket, we're going to have Shadow versus Omega. Now, I think Shadow easily gets the win there. Not much debate there. Shadow can... Will definitely easily take out um, Omega. And now we're going to have Rouge and Tails. Now, this Rouge and Tails is a hard one. Rouge, like, she has her power. She can fly, claw, do all that stuff a bat can do. But then Tails, with all his, like, gimmicks and mechs and stuff. But Tails, uh, Rouge is smart. Rouge is a government agent. Rouge knows, Rouge knows what's going on. And unlike We've seen Tails, like, run away from fights a lot. And I think Rouge... Now, Tails is smart. Keep that in mind. Tails is smart. But I think Rouge is a government agent. Rouge will know what to do. And I think Rouge will actually get the win over Tails here. Some of you guys might think that's absurd. But I think Rouge does actually get the win over Tails, surprisingly enough. Mainly due because in the, in the games we've seen Tails, like, run away from fights. And Rouge, being the government agent, could probably get through some of Tails' tactics and beat Tails. So now we're going to have Mephiles versus Silver. 
This was an interesting one, both from Sonic 06. Mephilus and Silver. Oh, this is a tough one. Hand to hand. Mephilus is just really, really, really strong. But we've seen, I believe Silver can most definitely take out Mephilus. So. Silver will get the edge here, mostly because I believe Silver can definitely take out Mephilus. Because Mephilus isn't all that. He really isn't. Because people think Mephilus is so strong because he, like, basically killed Sonic in Sonic 06. But that was because Sonic wasn't expecting it. If Sonic was expecting it, I'm pretty sure Sonic could have easily escaped Mephilus and beat Mephilus. All right, now our last matchup between Blaze and Metal Sonic. Um, I believe Blaze can most definitely take out Metal Sonic, so Blaze will get the win there because of his Blaze's fire and Metal Sonic is the robot. Ro Metal robots do not like fire. So, our Elite Eight matchups are now set: Sonic SBO, Vector Knuckles, Shadow Rouge, Silver Blaze. So, Sonic SBO is an interesting one. I think between them, Sonic can most definitely get the win there. Mostly because um, Sonic is just really fast. I don't think SBO's government, um, not government, but his stealthy things would really work against um, Sonic. Because Sonic is just fast and, you know, he's, he's just fast. So he will move on to the final four. Now we have Vector versus Knuckles. Now this is an interesting one. Vector is pretty strong. Knuckles is pretty strong. But I do believe Knuckles will get the win there. Mostly due to how just... I mean, they're both strong. But I do... Knuckles just has more experience fighting. If you know what I mean. Because Knuckles... Knuckles just fights. So... And their first Final Four matchup will be Sonic going up against Knuckles. Now we have Shadow Rouge. I don't think there's debate here. Shadow easily wins that matchup. Ooh, Silver Blaze. Silver Blaze. Um, this, this could most definitely go either way. Um, I can see both of them winning it. Silver with his telekinesis. Blaze with her... The thing is, we've seen how naive Silver is, and I think Blaze just has that experience that Silver doesn't. And but Silver has Silver has the better powers, yet Blaze has the experience. This is this is a tough one to choose. I won't even lie. This is a hard one to choose. But ah man, this is a tough one to choose. I'm gonna have to go with uh, Blaze. Blaze, because of the experience, and Silver just being naive as he is, Blaze just has that experience with the Soul Emeralds and everything. Blaze just has the experience, so Blaze will move on over Silver to the final four. So, ooh, <laughs> yo, I'm telling you, Sonic Knuckles about to be a problem to decipher. Sonic Speed, Knuckles Strength. Knuckles has the same strength. A sonic speed. <laughs> this would be a fight to the death. I'm not gonna lie. But if I had to choose here... Oh, man. This... First of all, this fight would come down to the wire. I'm gonna tell y'all that much. This fight would most definitely come down to the wire. Um, man, this is a tough one to choose. This is most definitely a tough one to choose. If I had to choose this one, I'd have. Okay, I think what would happen is like Sonic would be going in for the kill shot, but then Knuckles being as strong as he is. Because we've seen Knuckles single-handedly knock out the Chaos Emeralds out of Super Sonic in his base form. So, Knuckles is just that strong. So, I think Knuckles gets the win there, and Knuckles advances to the championship. So Knuckles advances to the championship, and now we're going to have Shadow versus Blaze. Now, I, 
Oof. Blaze most definitely can win this matchup. I mean... But Shadow... Shadow just... Mm, this is a tough matchup. This is a really tough matchup. If I had to choose... <laughs> okay, this would also be a come down to the wire fight. Both have experience. Shadow is just raw Shadow. Shadow. If Shadow were to take off those inhibitor rings, I don't know how Blaze could respond. And I do know Shadow can most definitely deal with fire. And we've seen Shadow also be able to deal with Silver's telekinesis abilities. So I do believe here Shadow would get the win over Blaze and move on to the championship. So now we have the championship. Knuckles versus Shadow. Um, I think this is definitely a, would be a close matchup, but I do think it would come down to the wire. But I actually do think Shadow would win this matchup because Shadow, Shadow just has that in him. Shadow just knows what he's doing. Shadow can most definitely fight. Knuckles would most definitely keep it a close game, but overall, Shadow would win the Sonic Brawl Championship. So, tell me what you guys think of this. Any matchups you think um, you would change? Um, you disagree with a matchup? Tell me in the comments below. I hope you guys did enjoy this video, and bye.